welcome to the Andy Griffith Show of Facts and Trivia. Appreciate you being here. Um, I ask you if you have not yet, please subscribe. We are jumping up, doing pretty good. Uh, but of course, well, there can always be more. Uh, want to ask for your. Want to apologize to you as to uh, I'm up pretty early doing this as time got away from me yesterday and I haven't shaved or anything yet, so <laughs> uh, doing it this morning. So. I uh, want to remind you that we are starting the contest on Monday for the mug. Uh, yeah, I would rather be watching the Andy Griffith Show mug. Uh, it's a very nice mug, actually. I may just keep it myself. Um, today's episode is on uh, Frisco Darling declares for Aunt B. And here we go. An episode of the Dick Van Dyke Show loosely following the same plot line and also featuring Denver Pyle aired two weeks after this one. Uh, both shows came from the same studio and had significant crossover in support act supporting actors. Um, the episode marks the only time the Darling Boys appear without their sister Charlene. Played by Maggie Peterson. The Dillards, um, an established bluegrass band featuring Doug Dillard, Rod Dillard, uh, reprised their roles as the Darlings of the Andy Griffith Show multiple times from 63 to 66. So if any of you have a question about whether the Darlings actually play the music, yes, they do. They are really fine, good, great musicians. Uh, trust me on that. Um, this episode includes the performances of four songs, including three that feature the music of the bluegrass band, the Dillards, uh, and Andy joins in on the guitar on three of those songs. Uh, altogether, they were the dueling banjos, Doug's tune, old Dan Tucker, and low and lonely. Uh, of course, Andy and Opie sing the duet, old Dan Tucker. Um... Aunt B recites uh, a poem uh, she used to perform in duet with Andy Taylor's aunt, uh, Florence, a, pa a fading flower of forgotten love by Agnes Elcott Strong. The poem was actually written by Andy Griffith show writer Everett Greenbaum. Um, right before dinner, the Darling Boys play the dueling banjos this song was later made famous in the 1972 film deliverance and this was the first time it was uh, actually played to uh, this large uh, scale and audience uh, on the Andy Griffith show uh, in the episode Briscoe sings uh, as a soloist for the first time and only time he sings a song called low and lonely usually Rodney or his sister Charlene do the singing um, Maggie Peterson was a good singer, uh, Charlene that is, uh, but I always like to listen to the boys sing personally. Um, veteran actor Denver Powell plays Frisco Darling. He played in seven episodes between 63 and 66. Seems like a lot more. Uh, kind of like Ernest T. Uh, there are the Darlings are coming, Mountain Wedding, Briscoe declares for Aunt B. Uh, Divorce Mountain Style, The Darling Baby, and The Darling Fortune. Um, Andy told Opie uh, that the children in Norway eat hardtack and raw fish. Uh, hardtack is actually a simple biscuit or cracker made from flour, water, and sometimes salt. Here's what I said on one reason when I did a uh, uh, video on Denver Pile. Uh, it's a little bit rough on the age. Uh, in this episode, Francis Bobbier was 61 years old, and Denver Powell was only 43. I thought he was like 49, but he was only 43. <laughs> Pretty cool, I thought. Anyway, that's all I got for you. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet. Please share these on Facebook. I appreciate it. Um, and don't forget the contest starts on Monday. Uh, let your friends know. Um, We'll just be asking somewhere in the video 
a trivia question, you got to answer it to get entered. And that's got to be correct answer. Anyway, appreciate you being here. Have a great day. Uh, God bless. Mm -hmm.